Hey, welcome back to Bear Squid. On this channel, we simplify educational tech. In today's video, I'm gonna show you uh, how you can present to your students on Google Me, as well as see all your participants using the iPad. Okay, so what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna to go to my app quickly, go to see my class. I've got 9A right now. And then I'm gonna go ahead and join that meeting. I'm gonna do the same thing here now. I'm gonna to go to, let's go to that app that I have. Okay, go home. And then go to that uh, same class and join the meeting. I don't wanna turn on, turn the camera off and the mic off. And go ahead and join that meeting. Now, here we go, yeah? Now, looking at this, these are students joining here. Okay, so what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna click on uh, screen share, okay, and start the screen broadcast, okay? And so while I'm doing this now, I can go ahead and choose any app that I wanna choose, and I'm gonna choose my PowerPoint, okay? I had a PowerPoint playing here, so I'm gonna go and uh, discard all of these. And now I can play my PowerPoint in full screen. So I can go ahead and play this in full screen, and at the same time, I'm on my call here with my students, so I can see all my students here. Hey guys, how's it going, you good? Yeah, good, okay. So what, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna quickly go ahead, I'm sharing my screen on my iPad so you can see my screen. The benefit of doing the PowerPoint is I can annotate on it. So here's the thing, I'm gonna do a starter question. Can you see the full screen on the PowerPoint? Can anyone give me the title of it? Okay, excellent. Before we do this, we are gonna do a question on the surface area of a pyramid, okay? So let me go ahead and do that as a starter question. Uh, because there's a lot to do with the pyramid. So here, here's a question. This is what I'm going to start off with. First thing first, I'm going to just call this TSA, okay? So total surface area. So if I'm going to work at a total surface area, there are two parts. There's the square base and then there's the triangular faces, okay? There's two parts to this, okay? So here you can see it's a square base. It's six by six, which just gives me 36 centimeters squared, okay? I just get 36 centimeters squared. I can also zoom into the presentation. You've got 36 centimeters squared for the square base, and what about the triangle? Now let's look back at that triangle, okay? You can see there's a slant height for the triangle, correct? This slant height here, five centimeters, is true for all of the slant heights here. So this one, this one, the two on the back, okay, they all have uh, this little dash here. So I'm gonna use A squared plus B squared is equal to C squared. I'm gonna be using Pythagoras. Feel free to share that with your colleagues, you may help someone out. Uh, and if you want more EdTech videos, make sure you subscribe, turn on notifications, and as always, I'll see you in the next one.